the 877 air microcontroller along with the assistance of a 8254 programmable interval timer driven by a 1 megahertz clock. A Java GUI controls the actual servo. As you can see there is a throttle and that goes from left to right and that controls the position of the servo. The communication is done via USB uh, serial to uh, USB converter right into the microcontroller. The 8254 has three 16-bit timers. One of the timers will be used as a time base and the other will be used for the pulse width. The time base counter <coughs> is operating in mode 2 and the pulse width modulation uh, timer is operating <coughs> in mode 1. The output of uh, the first timer goes to the second one. Here's the throttle at the minimum position. Let's take a look at the oscilloscope and see what it's doing. As you can see, very small pulses, uh, approximately one millisecond in length. The throttle is now at the halfway position. Let's take a peep at the oscilloscope again to see what's going on. As you can see, the pulses are getting bigger. Finally, full throttle, and the pulses are even bigger. They're actually two milliseconds in length. Watch the throttle as I move the GUI throttle. Server moves to the right, then it goes back to the left. Right, left, right, left. So I have total control of the servo from the GUI application in, written in Java.